Five, please. In a Wimbledon fortnight that has served up enough drama and intrigue to keep the crowds camped out on Hemman Hill entertained for months for the final four men who all face their own trials and tribulations along the way, one last challenge awaits to reach the final Sunday. After surviving a potential fiasco against Fernando Vadasco, next for Britain's number one Andy Murray in his fifth consecutive Wimbledon semi-final is Jerzy Janovic, a very different but equally frightening prospect. The 6 foot 8 inch 22 year old is the first pole to reach a Grand Slam semi final. The world number 22 goes for everything, serves bombs, and has little fear. And Murray lost to the pole at last November's Paris Masters after holding match point. She has a, a big serve. He's, uh, he's a big guy with a lot of power. He also um, has pretty good touch. He likes to hit drop shots. And, you know, he doesn't just whack every single shot as, as hard as he can. So. Um, it'll be a very tough match. He's played, uh, played extremely well here, I think. This is what I was dreaming uh, about. So, uh, as I can see, um, sometimes if you are dreaming about something really hard, it can actually happen. But I hope uh, deep down uh, I will still get uh, two more matches. The second semi-final features world number one Novak Djokovic and Argentina's gentle giant Juan Martin Del Potro. A repeat of last year's Olympic bronze medal match in which Del Potro triumphed on number one court. Neither man has dropped a set in the championships, so something has to give. And this will be the ultimate test for the Argentine's weakened left knee. If Del Potro can get into his nodding significant stride, this will be a contest to savour. But Djokovic has the edge in their overall head-to-head -head record of eight wins to three. I'm very, very proud of uh, proud of my uh, success on Grand Slams because that's exactly where I want to do my best and where I want to play uh, my top tennis. All the attention of the sport is focused on four Grand Slams, especially Wimbledon. So I'm, I'm really glad that I've been managing to to continuously make that uh, that uh, great success and reaching the you know at least final eight. It's my first semi-finals here. Another semi-finals in Grand Slam. Uh, after a couple of years, um, I think I'm, I'm I'm in the fight again with the with the top guys. Be one of the only four players in this tournament. It means a lot for for the future and for myself. It's that time of the championships when heroes are made and dreams are wrecked. Two men have been here before, but for the outsiders, a chance to write their names into Wimbledon folklore.